Hey, this your boy Jay Ross, man. I'm in Kansas City, y'all, for the Jazz Fest. Hey, my boy, a big dog, uh, 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 Aaron Mayfield, my dude, swoop me up, y'all. Some of y'all don't know, boy. Y'all think I'll be new to this stuff, man, but me and Aaron been running for about 10, 11, 12 years now. And, uh, Maybe for, more than that. More than that? Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, Aaron. 28 now, so. Yeah, it is more than it's that. It's more than that, man. It's more than that. But, yeah, man, y'all, y'all, I know everybody in the gospel world. For Kansas City and all over the country, you know Aaron, one of the best piano player, producers, and directors in the country. So all for all my folks that don't play uh, gospel music, I'm just wanting to hip y'all to them, man. But jazz festival right over there. But Aaron taking us down to get some some real food. Let him tell it. Some Jack Stack. Jack Stacks. I got to get my Jack Glock just in case. What? But. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, y'all, y'all hear him talking all that noise, talking about what he think he might need, and then when he show up, he gonna be all uncomfortable because it ain't that type of situation. All right. So what's that building over there? Which one? That one, the shiny building over there. Yeah, out the, the top. Uh, the oh, curve, the one with the curve. All right. So have you ever heard of Sydney, Australia? Yeah. They or there's a family here called the Kaufman family. Oh yeah. And yeah. what they did was they went to Australia and they literally paid a contractor to create a replica of the Sydney Opera House straight downtown Kansas City. Oh, we got to so see that. Just like we have the, um, the Peabody. Y'all got that one? Yeah, but there's... Nah, that's a real replica, though. Oh, we gonna, we gonna see. You wanna hey, go there now? It's up to you. All right, cool. Hey, you forgot to mention, y'all, but not for lack of love. Got my son, James, in the back, but I can't swing around, y'all. Lil' J3 turned 16 Wednesday. So we up in Kansas City celebrating and kicking up with Miguel, Jeanette Hurst. Uh, uh, playing at the Jazz Fest. Got to see my boy Cornelius Vaughn, bass player extraordinaire, live up here in Kansas City. But yeah, man. Yo, uh, let me do a couple of shout outs right quick. All right, so listen. Matter of fact, yeah, I'm about to do a Kansas City tour uh, with Jay Ross. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, here we go. Kansas City tour, y'all. Kansas City tour. All right, y'all, when y'all come to Kansas City, especially those of y'all who's playing, you know, maybe on tour or something like that, you might be playing at the Sprint Center or at the Crossroads, or the starlight, nine times out of ten, you'll be in this area. Yeah. You get a little shot of this area. Yeah. This is what you call the Arts District. And you'll probably be staying at the Sheridan or the Weston. Yeah. And that's that's where downtown is down there. Okay, right down there. Yeah, downtown is down there. But listen, y'all, when y'all when if y'all here on Fridays, or well, really any day of the week, y'all here on any day of the week, there's this spot that I'm about to show y'all right quick. It's called the Green Lady Lounge. They do jazz and funk and, and big band. And Hold on, man. I ain't no Bobby Jones on the shoe store. That says Bob Jones. No, it's Charlie Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby Jones got a shoe store in Kansas City. All right. Get a shot right here. What's that? All right. So y'all see this black building right there? Oh, that's yeah. a new building called the Black Dolphin. That's the Black Dolphin. Right. That's the Black Dolphin. But right here is called the Green Lady Lounge. Right here on Friday nights, there's this band called the Boogaloo 7. Boogaloo. One of the funkiest bands in Kansas City. Straight up. It's an organ player, four horns, uh, a four horn section, and a, a drummer and a percussionist and a guitar player. Killing it. Boogaloo 7. In the the say, Boogaloo in, 7. In KC. In KC. And that's the Sprint Center up there. Yeah. We're about to turn, but yeah. that's where the, a lot of you guys, when y'all be coming in town, uh, that's where y'all usually gonna play right there, at, yeah. Somewhere in this vicinity. Yeah. Uh, yeah, y'all we getting a tour of Kansas City with uh pianist and uh, producer extraordinaire, Aaron Mayfield, y'all. My long time homie. I mean when I first met Aaron and guitar. How many years did it go back at the guitar guitar center? And uh hey, him and Josh. Jay Ross was the only bass player. That I knew he had this little, if those of y'all who, who who have known J-Rock for a while, he used to have this bracelet. And it, was, <laughs> <laughs> and it was steel. And somehow or another, he came up with the brilliant idea of incorporating that bracelet in his bass plan. And <laughs> old school. <laughs> and what he, I mean, he, hey, listen, he really was Victor Wooten Jr. for about seven years straight like every year he was just killing i mean there's some things he was doing i still ain't heard nobody do yet 
Well, I appreciate that love, man. That ain't love, it's just the truth. Yeah, well, I appreciate the truth, man. But right now, all I do is tote this damn camera around. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this camera on my life, y'all. <laughs> Alright y'all. Oh, that's a good restaurant too. It's called the Snack Bar. Snack Bar in Kansas City, y'all. Yeah, that's a good restaurant too. It's called the Snack Bar. Now, if y'all, this area right here, especially if you're on first Fridays or whatever of the month, you got uh... That's when you get your check. Yeah, that's that. Well, <laughs> Everybody gets when they get my EBTs come in. That's where I hang out at. Yeah, if, if, you, if you're down here on first Fridays, they got an art festival that's down here every Friday. Yeah. Every Friday, alright? Okay, y'all. We about to come up on this uh, Kaufman State, uh, this Kaufman uh, Performing Arts Center uh, right now. Now that's the Webster House right there. If you want, if you got your girl during the day, you want somewhere a little bit romantic. That's where you go. All right. So here is. The, oh man, that is nice, ain't it? This is the this is the Kaufman Performance Center. That's where Wynton Marcellus be playing at when he comes in town. Man, that's beautiful. Yeah, like literally. Uh, people buy season passes or whatever and they be somewhere around the area of uh, like, you know I think around like 15 25 grand or something like that Golly. So yeah, when you go in there, it's this super black tie event and all that. All right This is a great view right here. All right. Y'all see that thing that's sticking up in the air It yeah, look like something the tower. Yeah, the tower. That's the World War one uh, Memorial either two or one. I think it's one all right, and yeah. then there you go. You got the hotel over there with the with the spiraling. Oh uh, yes, yeah, so uh, Jeanette's staying there. Okay. Yeah, that that used to be a restaurant called Skies. Used to have some of the best steak in the world. Man. All right, now when we finish eating, I'm gonna take y'all over by the bottoms, and this those that the actual bottoms, the bottoms. Uh, those of y'all might have seen a a movie called Casino. Uh huh. It's with uh, Robert De Niro. All right. And uh, Joe Pate whatever. Joe Pesci. Yeah, pro yeah, him. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Aaron running stop run slide. <laughs> hey, he got it like that in Kansas City, y'all. He gangsta. Nah, nah, nah. And uh, the bottoms is where they actually uh, ran all of Vegas. There's the, there's still actual spots of where it actually all went down. Straight up, I yeah. remember that because I remember they had to send the money back to Kansas City all the time. Yeah. In the movie. Yeah. So. Yeah, the, and some of those families still alive and still kicking real Man. high with the money. So, you know, Kansas City, you know, a lot of people, yeah, a lot of people might be. Wait a minute, we got a Missouri plate, y'all, St. Louis. No, they ain't, no, they ain't they, from the loop. No, nah, Missouri's a state. Yeah. It's not city. Yeah. Yeah. I got you. It's all right. Yeah. Look at him. Yeah. I'm going to see Aaron get his ass whooped in his own, <laughs> in his own city. <laughs> all right, y'all see these buildings over here? Which ones? Right here? Yeah, all yeah. over this, all over here. This is pretty much all those, all these buildings over here are pretty much old school shops or factories. And like any other city, they turn them into lofts yeah. and, and all that type of stuff. But this is pretty much where the uh, the new uh, uh, the, the the new generation of you know like. Uh, Right before they become home builders, I mean homeowners and all that type of stuff. Uh -huh. This is where they usually buy their uh, their living spaces at. Man. Where from. All right, so we just made it over here in the fret house area. Uh, there's the train station. There's the Union Station, Kansas City Union Station, the famous joint. Yeah. Right over there. Man. Yeah, that train will take you straight to St. Louis. Well, damn it, we need to be on that one. <laughs> Straight up. I'm ready to get back to the loo. But y'all, hey man, we're gonna go ahead and get this grill bone. Oh yeah, we and we're gonna get some footage of uh of of uh Jay trying this food from Jack Stack. Aaron Spears, my man Aaron Spears, uh good friend of mine, he came down here to this very spot. And uh, I told him, I said, now Doc, when you taste this, you're gonna get orders some more. I kid you not, he had this thing called the Fire Kiss Wings and the Carrot Cake. After the first bite, he bought 10 of them. Man, let me tell y'all something about Aaron Spears, okay. man. He would have ate them sap suckers if they would have came out of White Castle, man. 
Hey, I done been to dinner with Ern, Ernie fried okra and everything else, Listen, man. Listen, no, I believe in good food. If, if you're going to eat it, it needs to be good. Yeah, if y'all notice, I gained a lot of weight. And But let's just say this. It all was not in vain. <laughs> <laughs> it was not all. I enjoyed the trip. Now, I'm going to be... I, I, I'm, I got a lot of work ahead of me, but I ain't, I ain't scared to do it because I did it like twice before. But listen, y'all, if you're going to eat food, make sure it's good. <laughs> ain't no sense in, <laughs> in, in gaining weight, and it's because of terrible food. No. Oh, yeah. If you're willing to pay the price, make sure you get a good product. All right. Let's go see what they got, y'all. Jack right. Stacks, here we let's, go. Let's, to, let, let's show them the sign. All right. Let's get off. All right, y'all. Let me get out the car, y'all. Uh, Yo, he put on these terrible shoes. Well, I got on my driving shoes. I left my my concert shoes in the truck. I mean, in the car. All right, y'all. It's all white people. My son says it's all white people. You don't need your gun. Y'all see it right over there? Jack Stack. It's Where Jack. It's Jack Stack. Let me see. That's where we at, y'all. Jack Stack. Let's go see what Aaron talking about. Like they got a pretty eclectic array of customers. I don't have to pull my patty bag, you know. <laughs> All right, y'all, we out.